Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another gear raffle and review. Today, we're going to talk about the Noco X Grid uh, USB charger. So, let's get right into it. Yummy. All right, guys. Uh, first off, I want to talk about the the Noco, the company. I think that it's either N O C O or Noco. Uh, they offer so many different varieties of, of well power, whether it be like a USB uh, external battery charger or solar chargers or you know battery chargers for your your truck or for your car or golf carts. Go you know any kind of battery power they offer, and it's all really heavy duty and rugged. So you know, go over to the website and, and check it out. This is not all they offer. So first off, out of the package, like I was just saying, rugged. These things are waterproof, shockproof. They are built, I hope that wasn't too loud. <laughs> Knocking stuff off my desk. These things are super, super rugged and built to last. I would be, I, I would feel comfortable just going out in the yard and just throwing this thing. Uh, it's surprising how well built these things are, but it's at a sacrifice to uh, to weight. And I think they come in at 13.9 ounces for this model here. Now this model is a 12,000 milliamp. This is their biggest of the USB chargers. I think there's four other models that scale down and progressively get smaller. So this is as heavy as they come, but you know it holds a lot of charge for any kind of backpacking and camping this thing would be great you wouldn't have to worry about it getting wet um and we'll talk about through hiking here in a bit but as far as camping goes um or just as like a, a security having it in the glove box of your of your car or if you're have a camper and you're, you you know you go camping or whatever um this is a great great piece of gear to have i think this piece of gear best fits um anybody with a really rugged job whether it be everything that keeps popping into my head is a logger or somebody that is going to be in the woods in the mud in the the dirt and the grime all of the time and you know needs to make sure that he can have his, his phone charged or someone on an oil rig or i'm talking this thing is rugged uh that's where i see that it fits really really well because i don't believe like i just said that you know it is good for camping or would work well for camping i think it's a little bit overkill but at a price of this is a fifty dollar you know battery, for fifty dollars you might as well have this much protection. All right, digging in, uh, it has got dual USB ports, which is you know convenient, especially like Sharon and I when we were on our through hike, we used a battery charger about this size. It was actually the Snow Lizard charger. Uh, it was an 11,000 milliamp, a little bit smaller, but uh, having two ports was nice. Now, if you're going to be a solo hiker, uh, you probably won't need quite as much battery power, but for a couple people, this battery makes sense. Nice to have the two ports. Um, it's also got a port here on the side that's got a spot for your charging and also a spot that hooks up to their brand of solar chargers. They have an array of different solar chargers that you know, are compatible and work well with their gear. I would like to, you know, potentially uh, also review one of their solar chargers. It's also got uh, a little light here that, well, it's convenient if you're, you know, say your headlamp goes dead, it's nice to have a, a light on it. Um, but really, other than that, it's very self-explanatory. This is actually a very low charge. There's four buttons. I don't know if you can see here. Uh, they go from 25%, I think, to... Uh, to 50 to 75 to 100 it just tells you how much the battery is charged that's it right there i mean other than the fact that this is heavy and well, let's jump into that really quick it is it is very heavy and if you guys are out there and you're considering through hiking probably not the battery pack for you uh, something lighter like this snow lizard comes in at nine ounces a uh, 9.2 and especially if you're a solo hiker, you know, get one of those ones that's just like this little stick and it's going to fit you much better for that, for your through hike, it's gonna be much lighter. I know some of you guys are worried like, oh, but this is waterproof and shockproof. There's gonna be a spot in your bag that's relatively safe um, from, you know, shock. You're only gonna use this potentially in your, your tent at night. You could pack it away. And as far as waterproof goes, guys, guys, 
through hiker if you're gonna get on the trail on through hike these things are your best friends no sense in buying fancy waterproof anything this right now is waterproof Ta -da! that's all you need to do um, there's no sense, well actually it's not now, it didn't zip, but there's no sense going through and buying expensive waterproof things for a through hike. Uh, you're only going to use this in your tent at night. Ziploc bag makes anything waterproof, only anything that'll fit in the bag. I'm not ready, I'm not ready, I'm not ready, I'm not ready. Alright there guys, there's my quick review of the NOCO X Grid. And now it is time for the raffle. And like always guys, if you're new to these raffles, just click here. This should be the link to my Patreon site. And for $1 a month, you'll be entered in every single gra every <laughs> graffle that I do. But without further ado, we are going to raffle off the NOCO X-Grid USB charger. And the winner is... <laughs> number... Number... Number 43, and number 43 is Brian Britton. Brian Britton, you are the winner of the NOCO X-Grid Power Charger. Congratulations! I hope that you've enjoyed this video. I hope that it's been informative. If you guys have any other information on power chargers um, of this style, you know, let's open up the comments below to di discussing, you know, this kind of gear. Up next on the gear raffle and reviews, we're gonna cover all of those foot things that we had going on. And first we're going to cover this kind of camp shoe. It's a imitation croc that works really well. So that's coming up next. And if you like today's t-shirt, visit shirtmandude.com. But until then guys, remember, these reviews are just my opinion. And if you don't like it, you can go take a hike. Bye bye. Really, every single graffle? <clears throat> I like it, I dig it, I want more of it.